One way orthodontics and dentistry has changed in the past 15 years is the advent of uh, three-dimensional x-ray units. It's called CBCT, which stands for Cone Beam Computed Tomography. And it's really grown in orthodontics and in dentistry within the past several years because it really allows us to see three-dimensionally how the bones are growing, where the positions of teeth are, and we've, we've heard about it mainly through implant dentistry. So if a patient needs an implant at the general dentist or the specialist, they very often have a CBCT taken. Now we're using it in orthodontics to get a really good idea of three-dimensional growth and development. And we also use it to look at airways. And one reason we're interested in looking at airways is the way that a patient breathes has a lot to do with growth and development of the jaws and the head and neck and face re regions. So when we're looking at airways, it allows us to see enlarged tonsils, enlarged adenoids, and any nasal structures that might be preventing patients from breathing adequately through their nose. And it adds to that ability to really fully diagnose a case and make sure that we're taking care of all the underlying problems and that better allows us to treat a patient uh, efficiently.